It's time to step into a world of creativity and culture as the contemporaries of the Columbia Museum of Art host its annual ball. And this year's theme I'm so excited about is Neon Dreams, a pop art affair. And joining us this morning for a preview of the big event are board members Robbie Burns and Shayla Merritt. Thank you both so much for waking up really early to hang out with us. <laughs> no, thank, thank you so you. much for having us. Yeah, All right, it. so first let's talk about who are the contemporaries? What do you guys do? Yeah, so uh, we are the Young Professionals Board, um, kind of the, the contemporary art uh, focus part of the Museum of Art. Um, and so what we're, our goal is to support the museum through art acquisition of contemporary pieces. Um, and so that's what our, our ball goes towards is helping us generate and raise funds to buy uh, new pieces of art to support the museum. Absolutely, and what's so interesting is people may not know what that process looks like. Like you have to raise the money in order to get this great art here to make the capital city a art destination, right? Absolutely. And so this ball is so important. Speaking of the ball, I kind of told you guys a little bit about the theme. Let's talk more about the theme. <laughs> the ne We're talking neon, bright colors. I mean, you can see that over here. Uh, so what's the theme more about? Well, so I think it's a continuation of what we had last year. It's this idea of really making sure that everyone knows that they're welcome here. So bright colors, vibrancy, sparkle, shine. I mean, it's really all about bringing everybody together. And then obviously the theme is really all about the celebration of pop art. Yes, pop art has been really popular too. You see a lot of people talking about that on social media. Now for folks who buy tickets and want to attend uh, the event this weekend, what can they expect? So we don't want to give too much away. Okay, <laughs> yeah. just give us a little, a little preview, a little snippet. But I will say the ball committee and um, Robbie here is our acquisition chair. They have put a lot into this, and so there's going to be a lot of different activation stations. Um, I'm really excited, honestly, to see what people are going to show up and mm -hmm. wear because of the theme, because it's so vibrant. Um, but I feel like, I don't, like I said, I don't want to tease too much. Yeah. But I think you should expect a really good time. I feel like the music's going to be great. The food's going to be great. I'm all about partying with a purpose. Ooh, and partying yes, with a purpose. Um, and it's all, like Robbie said, to raise money for the Art Acquisition Fund. And why is it so important for the Columbia community, uh, the Midlands community, to come out to this event? Well, I think it's really a reflection of like the burgeoning art scene in the Midlands, right? And I think it's probably been underrated over time. And um, with Columbia becoming more of a regional hub, uh, I think this is a great reflection of the steps that we've taken as a, you know, as a group um, and as a local community to, to kind of build step by step to, to, show, to show out and show off. Yes, yeah, show out and show off. We love that. <laughs> um, so really quickly, I also want to talk about these incredible pieces that we have around us. I'm understanding that this one was recently shown off. Tell us about this one. Yeah, so this is from Victoria Rickards. Uh, she's local to Columbia, but she was featured uh, in December down in Art Basel in Miami. So um, wow. kind of big, fun pieces, uh, very creative, obviously. Um, and then um, to my right, or to your right as well. Oh, I love um, this piece. Is, a, is another piece from Shelby LeBlanc. So Shelby was our, our top sale last year at, mm -hmm. at the art auction. Um, and so she's brought together a handful of pieces and curated some pieces for us. Um, so we're really excited to feature her again. Um, but this really just kind of pops. And I think that that's kind of what we're looking for there. So there's about 40 to 50 pieces we've curated um, for, the, for the auction itself. And we're really excited to kind of see people, you know, there's things from about $50 all the way up to several thousand dollars that you can bid on, so. Yeah. Yeah, so it, it fits the budget, right? Yes. So we have a nice wide <laughs> range here. Now, really quickly, of course, I have to ask you guys, where can people buy tickets if they want to attend this weekend's event? Of course, well, we'll make it really easy for you. Just head on over to the Columbia Museum of Art, um, columbiamuseumofart.com slash contemporaries, and you'll scroll down that page and you'll click on um, the gala link, and then that will literally take care of itself and you'll be able to purchase tickets. Absolutely. Shayla, you said it best. Party with a purpose. <laughs> Robbie, you were talking about showing up and showing out. And my friends, again, the opportunity to do that. This event taking place on March 2nd from 7 to 11 in the evening. And again, we want to make Columbia, we want the world to know that Columbia is a great destination for art. Absolutely. Absolutely. All right.